This is my life story. You were born today, a boy, in a village in Vietnam's Ha... I apologize profusely to anybody who's Vietnamese or knows how to pronounce these things. I don't know how to pronounce half of these words. I was born today, a boy, in a village in Vietnam's Ha Giang province, not far from the city of Ha Giang. Oh, funny how that works. Your parents have named you Don. Don Truong. Well, that's the... That's a great name. That's me. Just call me Dong. Don. Just Don. Never mind. So, my father is J. Yup. My mother is Ngok. And my brother is Kadao. My father's a policeman and makes 3.9 million Vietnamese dollars. Or $256.81 in American money. Mother is a homemaker. My brother is a homemaker. He's also six, so my brother's a six-year-old homemaker. All right, cool. And I am zero, and I don't have a job. Let's see. So I was just born. My happiness is 39, so I'm a relatively unhappy baby. However, my intelligence is 82, so I'm a smart baby. I'm sort of artistic, pretty musical, kind of athletic, pretty strong, pretty enduring. 97 out of 100 appearance. I am one sexy baby. And 39 out of 100 conscience, but what do babies know? They just pee and vomit everywhere. Uh, income versus nation, little graphs on Vietnam and how it's not terribly great. Uh, I don't know if this means I have less than the average or more than the average. I don't know. Green bar and lines. Uh... Diet. Adequate. Home. Simple. Safe water. No. I think this is supposed to scroll down more, but it doesn't. Oh. Okay, well now we don't have any safe water because that field just disappeared. Great. Alright, great. Water's gone. From my parents, I have been gifted with the potential for exceptional good looks. Oh, so I've got the potential to be pretty. Might not actually be pretty. So, I'm in Vietnam. Currency is the dong. Uh, political rights, there aren't any, that's why it's in red. Uh, corruption, it's bad. Civil liberties, they're bad. Government social services are... average, I guess? Anyway, that is how the world is like now that I've been born, so time to age. Your mother's found a job. Now, my mother is a part-time laborer, bringing home 60 bucks a month. Which is, if I were to stream full-time, probably just about as much as I would make. Age a year. Rice and noodles are the staple food of Vietnam. And also, most college students. Now, I'm two years old. Wow. You have come down with a case of food poisoning. Well, that's not good. I'm a pretty... And sick baby, I guess. Vietnam is a humid, tropical climate. Did you know that? Sporadic localized fighting has erupted in Lai Chao province. I suffered a case of food poisoning. But it's not on the list, so I guess it's not a big deal. Most Vietnamese practice a combination of Buddhism, Confucianism, and Taoism. Okay. Vietnam has four main regions, the Northern Mountains, the Red River Delta, the Anam, and Central Highlands, and the Mekong Delta. Oh, wait, I thought that was five. This is apparently one. Learn more, please. No, thanks, I'm good. So, I'm now four years old. Now I'm five. But first, I need to get... Yeah. I need to tell you guys that France occupied all of Vietnam by 1884. Independence was declared until whatever. Okay, five years old. I don't understand any of those words. Buddhist, Buddhists, Buddhists do not believe in a transcendent God, heaven, or hell. Yeah. I'm five years old. I'm not really thinking about these kind of things. I'm kind of wondering where my case of food poisoning went, actually. Buddhism was founded by Siddhartha Gautama, who was born in what is now Nepal in 562 B.C. You have a new... Oh God, that's a great name. You have a new baby sister named Tron. 
Damn, that's a badass name. Tron. That's fantastic. You've begun school this year. Woohoo! Your brother Kadao's girlfriend, Luan, has pertussis. Well, that's not good. My brother's 13. What the hell does he know about love? You have come down with a case of food poisoning. Again. Age a year. Your mother's found a new job. Now she's a part-time shoemaker, which is better than part-time laborer, I guess. Your brother Kadao has found a job. He's a laborer. And now that I'm eight, I can uh, decide what I want to do in my free time. Which I guess I couldn't do when I was seven. What do I want to do? I want to play. I want to watch TV. I'm a very pretty eight-year-old, 97 out of 100 appearance, so I guess I should do fashion. And I'm also smart. How about, I don't know, reading, like a big dork. Uh, what else? Sports, maybe? Am I better at sports than art? I'm better at music. Oh, wait, I just pick a bunch of things. Sports and art. Oh, wait, I'm better at sports than I am at art, so forget the art. Due to the hot, sticky climate, Vietnamese prefer lightweight clothing. Wow. I really feel like I'm there. Now I'm nine years old, and nothing happened. As a Buddhist, you will endeavor to follow what is called the Eightfold Path. Major flood has hit Vietnam. 58 people have died, and 1.9 million others have been affected. You and your family were not directly affected by the disaster. Woohoo! Now my appearance is 99. The flood made me even prettier. Either that, or just the average appearance of everybody else went lower. I'm really not sure. Your brother, Kadao's girlfriend, Luan, has graduated from secondary school. Okay. Oh, 97. Pretty. Why does my prettiness go up and down? Doesn't seem like a thing that should oscillate that much. Your brother, Kadao, decided to move out. Eh, yeah, screw him. Luan... Nguyen... Nigo... Nig... Uh... I got this. Text to speech. Uh... Luan... Nig... Oh, man. Nguyen, apparently? I'm not good at names or anything, really. I didn't hear you. It's pronounced Nguyen. Alright. Thanks, Microsoft Anna. You did it. Alright, well, now they're engaged at the ripe old age of... Oh, wait, he's not in my family anymore. I guess I'll never know. Oh, he's 18. Perfect. That's why his wisdom is 22. Now they're married. Now he's been drafted into the military. That's fantastic timing. Your sister Tron has... Wait, what? Your sister Tron has will not be able to attend school. Well, apparently the guy who made this game has not been able to attend school either. You've come across a mess left by another unknown individual. It disturbs you that anyone would leave such a mess. You have some time. Will you clean up the mess? Well, are these really the problems that face me on a day-to-day -day basis? What do you guys think? Do I clean it? Do I clean this mess? Learn more. I want to learn more about the mess. Is it like hypodermic needles, or...? If you don't clean it up, then someone else will eventually need to. No one's around to see you clean up the mess, though, so don't expect to ever be thanked for your work. Well, jeez, that's a really fatalist way to look at things. I'm gonna clean it. Ugh. I just increase my wisdom. And my conscience. Age a year. Your father has come down with visceral left... Oh, God. Visceral leishmaniasis? Leishmaniasis? Uh, it's a parasitic infection transmitted to humans by the bite of a blood-sucking sandfly. 
Well, that's great. Your family circumstances have enabled you to move into a nicer, more expensive dwelling. Gee, Dad, you should get sick more often. You have come upon a beggar who is asking for 100 dongs. Will you give him the money? I'm not going to laugh. More mature than that. I will give him 100 dongs. That's no problem. Thank you for helping out. Thanks to you, a family will have some food tonight. I'm happy for it. You have been doing extraordinarily well in school, and the school administration recommends that you move forward a year. Would you like to skip a year of school? Yes! I hate my peers. They're all dweebs. Let's see, my monthly income is 5.1 million dongs, or... 33... $337. So somehow my income is now less than my expenses. Uh... I cannot change this, though, because I am only 13. I will figure that out eventually. Age a year. Your father's been cured of leishmaniasis. Leishmaniasis, still can't pronounce this. Poor Vietnamese villagers live in houses of woven bamboo and thatch. Thank you, Encarta 2007 and World Book Online. I am 14 years old. Still a pretty 14-year-old. Your family has moved to a less expensive dwelling to save money. One made of bamboo and thatch. As a Buddhist, you are expected to follow a number of concepts and practices. Well, you mentioned that before, but it's good for reinforcement. You know, it's nice to know that there are indeed things in Buddhism. It's more than just a name. Some of your friends smoke cigarettes. It seems to be common in your peer group. Will you join them? Smoking cigarettes is a social norm in some groups. Some people find it relaxing and enjoyable. Smoking cigarettes has been clearly linked to heart disease and cancer and shown to reduce life expectancy. It is also expensive. I'm going to say no, because I'm too pretty to smoke. Take that. Now I have no friends, but at least I'm pretty. Your brother Kadao has come down with appendicitis. Cool. Your brother Kadao's tour of military service is over. You've met a new bull- oh, wait. Oh, my character's gay. Cool. More power to you, friend. You've met a new boy named Cam... Oh, God, I still can't pronounce his name. Cam... Nguyen? New... Wait, is this related to my... Wait, whoa, whoa. Is this character that I'm romantically attracted to related to the sister that my brother is dating? Is... Is that... What? I'm so lost now. You know what? Just fine. Whatever. Yeah, I would love to get involved with Cam Nguyen. He feels the same way. <laughs> He's very athletic. Appearance is 44. He's not that pretty, but that's okay. I'll make up for that. Happiness is 32. So he's even less happier than me. Less happier. Less happy. English. Yeah. Let's get married. Your brother Kadao has recovered from depression. I didn't know he was depressed. The fighting in Lai Chao is over. Yes. Sure. You have graduated from secondary school. Good. Some of your friends smoke cigarettes. No! No! Cam Nguyen has broken up with me! Oh. You know what? Too pretty for you anyway, Cam. Get bent. I've met a new boy, though, named... Oh, how many people in the Nguyen family am I going to marry? Name not Nguyen... 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 Ugh. Sure. Yeah, I'll just marry his brother, then. You break up with me, I'll just... Go behind your back and date your brother. Yes. Love to get involved romantically. Your parents do not approve of Nat Nguyen. 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 Will you insist on seeing Nat? Yes! Your parents say they will kick you out if you continue to see Nat. Will you continue to resist them? Yes, I will! My parents have kicked me out for continuing to see Nat Nguyen. Oh. Well. Just you and me, Nat. It's alright. 
we'll figure this out. I don't need them anyway. It's not new j I don't- I'm sorry! Screw you, mom and dad! Uh, starvation, yeah. Zero dongs per month. That doesn't seem like a great deal. I don't have any money. Uh, subsistence? Makeshift? Uh, no charity? Okay. It's time for you to earn some money. Please look for a job. Okay. Uh, boop -ba -doo -doo -doo. Oh, I can be... What can I be? I can be a miner. That sounds awful. I could be a construction worker. That sounds awful. I could be a blacksmith. I could be a potter. Uh, eh, miner, whatever. You did not get the job. Would you like to find another one? Yes, I would like to be a miner. Would I like to... Yes, I'd like to be a miner. Congratulations, you'll work as a miner. Keep asking, you'll get anywhere. Uh, let's see. Oh, my appearance is 99, so I'm a really pretty miner. A miner in multiple respects. I'm also 17. Ha ha ha. Oh, sorry. Uh, art, sure. Clothing and appearance, of course. Socializing. And, well, if I do activism, I will get thrown in jail. So, I'm gonna say studying, because I'm a dork. I'm a dorky miner. I'm spending very little. Would I like to reconsider? Yes, now I have money. I'm going to be an, an, a careful shopper. Adequate food er Ample fooder, actually. Simple one room. Oh, wait, that doesn't add. Uh, simple one room, yeah. Can I move in with my guy now? Seek new romance. Oh, I can't propose marriage. That's right, it's not legal in Vietnam. Can I... Can I move to America? Where we can get married. Can we get married? I don't even know. This is from 2007. Do they even have any civil unions in the U.S. in 2007? Am I going to have to move to, like, Massachusetts? I don't think New Jersey had them then. Uh, let's see. Residence. Whoops. I didn't mean to click that. No, nope, go. Move to Canada. Sure, why not? Emigrate. Choose a new country. Oh. What about Liechtenstein or Luxembourg or Madagascar? Mm, too late, the ports are already closed. Canada, please. You do not have enough money to emigrate legally. Would you enter, enter, enter illegally? Yes, please. I don't have enough money for that either. All right, cool. So... Uh, God, I really cut back on my expenses. Diet. Adequate. Charity. Nothing. Miserly shopper. Shelter is basic. Alright. And we're off. My mother has developed arthritis. Well, she kicked me out. She deserves it. Your brother Kadao's wife, Luan, Luan, has found a job. That's great. Your sister, Tron, has found a job. Your boyfriend, Nat, has graduated from secondary school. Your boyfriend, Nat, has found a job. Your boyfriend, Nat, has been drafted into the military. Oh. Health problems are stunting. Some of your friends like to drink alcoholic drinks. Will you join them? No! Too pretty for that. You have been drafted. Uh... Is the option... No, okay, I cannot bring my sexuality into this. Apparently, that does not matter. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't have enough money. I'm gonna apply for conscientious, conscientious objector status because I am... Uh, oh, not available. You serve the military or go to prison. Will you serve? No! You've been sentenced to two years in prison. Oh. Oh, well. Happy 19th birthday in jail. I'm still really pretty. You have been released from prison. Nat, no, oh, no, he broke up with me. Oh, no. Uh. Oh, I can be a nursing aide. Cool. That's 1.5 million dongs. Let's see. 
Appearance, socializing, all these. Fine. You have received a 4% pay raise. That's great. I didn't do anything. Love and relationships. Seek new romance. I met a new man named... View... That's the same last name! View... We... Nguyen. Whom you are very taken with. Occupation soldier. Sure, why not? Just marry this entire family. He feels the same way. Oh, We've begun seeing each other. Great. Age a year. No, not smoking. No. You have a good deal of cash. Would you invest it? Yeah! I'm going to invest all my money in high-risk stock. I'm going to invest... Oh, wait. I have 20... Wait. I have 21 million dongs. Whoa, whoa. Hightailing it to Canada. It's enough dongs to get me anywhere. Oh, no it isn't. I need 49 million dongs. Never mind. <sighs> Got a dearth of dongs here. Age a year. Your sister Tron has found a new job. Professional robot. Haha, <laughs> get it. No. Your spending is creeping up. Oh, so now I'm spending 600,000 more dongs than usual. A famine or food shortage has hit Vietnam. 28,013 people have died, and 3.1 million others have been affected. Okay. You are not directly affected. Alrighty. That's good. How did my spending creep up that much? Uh, finances, please. Monthly expenses. How did I go to Apple? No. Miserly. Don't be an average shopper. Nothing average about you, Doan. Your brother, Kadao's wife, Luan, has found a new job. Your sister, Tron's boyfriend, Kadao. Wait. Isn't Kadao my brother? What? I'm... Did I misread something here? Am I getting the names mixed? Oh, I don't even know. Yes. Great. I... Uh... Okay, fine. We're, we're all just sort of in one big, happy relationship. Yes. Your sister Tron's boyfriend, Kadao, has found a job. All right. Now he's in the military. Now my boyfriend's military service is over. Now he has a job. Some of my friends like to drink alcohol. God, I gotta drink alcohol to forget about all this incest going on. Ah, uh, no. Too pretty to drink. No. Not spending any money. What's my net income? Do I have enough dongs for Canada? Will Canada accept the dongs I have? Uh, where'd I go? Uh, invest. Okay, almost, I think. I can marry? Can I? Propose marriage! Oh, It's generally not allowed, but we love each other a lot. Oh, We'll go to Canada. I'll show them. My sister Tron found a new job. I've got a 7% pay raise? Okay, great. Hi-ho, Canada. Uh, do, 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 emigrate to Canada. I've been caught. Oh no, my dongs. I've been caught and I've been deported. I lost 49 million dongs. Oh no. That's all of them. Hmm. How am I gonna get out of here? I can't go to the Netherlands. I don't have any money. I am now dongless. Where is the emigrate button? I'll try the Netherlands. You should be under N. I would assume. I need... 49 million dongs. Hey, go figure. Guess what I just lost? Invest it in the stock market. I don't have anything to invest. I got 9 million dongs. Fine. High risk stock. Amount. 9 million. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Invest, please. Thank you. Liabilities. Zero dongs. Age a year. You're not making any contributions to charity. Too bad. 
Major flood has hit Vietnam. 17 people have died and 4 million others have been affected. Okay. You are not affected. Alrighty. No, I can't revert. That's cheating. No, he broke up with me. Oh. Why we... Why? Uh. My father's been hurt on an on-the-job accident, but suffered no permanent injury. My father scraped his knee. How old is he now? Oh, it doesn't even tell me. Your father's contracted malaria. Through his scraped knee. Your sister Tron has found a new job. Your sister Tron's boyfriend Kadao's tour of military service is over. Your sister Tron's boyfriend Kadao has found a new job. Your spending is creeping up. How did I spend 700,000 more dongs? Where did these come from? Miserly shopper, stop spending money. Adequate meals. That's enough. Age a year. Kadao, Nguyen, and your sister Tron have married. Alright, so... Sure, he's a scavenger of used goods. What a catch. Your sister Tron decided to move out. Well, I'm not at home, I don't care. A major flood has hit Vietnam. 23 people have died and 2.2 million others have been affected. You're not directly affected. Okay. You're spending very little. Don't care. Do I have enough money to go to the Netherlands? Oh, wait. I don't even need to go to the Netherlands. Nobody... Nobody loves me anymore, so... I can move anywhere. I can move to North Korea. That would be great. Uh, emigrate, please. I don't like the Netherlands because I don't know anything there. Let's go to Canada. Uh, I need to cash in my investments before emigrating. Alright. How much are my investments worth? Nothing. Nothing. I bet. Oh, I invested 9 million, I think? I now have 11 million. That's pretty good. Cash in, please. Nice. My appearance is still 97. And... Hi-ho, Canada, please. Yeah. These communities will accept you. Yellowknife, Northwest Territories. Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island. Regina in Saskatchewan. London, Ontario. Hamilton, Ontario. Edmonton, Alberta. Montreal, Quebec. White Horse, Yukon Territory. Toronto, Ontario. Heard of that one. Vancouver, British Columbia. Victoria, British Columbia. I don't know. One of these. Just not the French part. So, not Montreal, please. Uh, somebody in the chat says Toronto is an awesome place to be gay, so I guess that'll work. You have moved to Toronto! Woohoo! Your mother has been cured of arth yeah, arthritis. Sure, that's fine, I guess. Oh, man. No, this is a total fabrication. There's no crime in Canada. You have the opportunity to steal some merchandise of considerable value. Others in your community have a lot more money than you do. Stealing might help your finances. Will you steal the merchandise? Hmm, it's tempting. It's very tempting. Hmm. Oh, it's so tempting. I want to do it. But I feel like I shouldn't. Ah, uh, fine, I'll... no. Some bicycles in your neighborhood would be easy to steal. People have left them poorly protected. Will you attempt to steal a bicycle to ease your financial plight? Oh yeah, like the 50 bucks I'd get from that would make all the difference. No thanks. You met a new man named Nathan Harvey. I can pronounce that one. To whom you are attracted to. Would you like to get involved romantically? Hell yeah, I would. We can steal bikes together. Time for you to earn some money. Alrighty. I can be a police inspector? How do I qualify to be a police inspector? Fine. Great, now I'm a cop. A sexy cop, of course. 97 appearance. Uh, fashion, of course. Socializing. Reading and... I guess physical training, because I'm a cop and I need to... figure out how to beat up people. Oh, no, wait, I'm better at art, so I need to be able to paint people being beaten up. Yeah, I'd say 4.4 grand a month is not too bad for a 
somebody who illegally emigrated to Canada. Also, how do I spend only $45 a month? That's a little bit nutty. Uh, leisure finances. Uh, monthly expenses, please. Meager, no, adequate meals. 120 Canada dollars. You know, that's, that's the official currency of Canada. It's the Canada dollar. Charitable donations. Saintly. Consumer items. Ah, average shopper. I'm just going to give everything to charity. Yes, Riotson, you uh, have it down. I'm an illegal immigrant gay Vietnamese... Um, well, immigrant, I already said. Living in Toronto who is a police force as an inspector. Yeah, that's about it. Um, you know, apparently being an illegal immigrant, an illegal immigrant, yeah, does not preclude you from getting a job in the police force. Actions, please. Finances again, I'm gonna spend all my money. Actually, no, I'm going to invest all of my money in horrible, horrible things. How much money? Net worth, 913 Canada boy... <laughs> I was reading the chat, I thought they said 913 Canada boyfriends. Because I was reading what uh, Renard in the chat said. It's uh, Canada dollars. The currency is not in boyfriends. Although that would make the game more interesting. Let's just invest all of it into high-risk stock. Invest all my boyfriends and age a year. My sister Tron's husband, Kadao, has found a new job. Your spending's creeping up. How? Where did I just... Where did that $3,000 in expenses come from? I'm not putting up with this. Simple. Lavish. No, adequate. Charity. Spendthrift. Average shopper. Jesus. I'm not spending 10 more than the average. 10 times more. I propose marriage. Oh, same-sex marriage isn't allowed in Canada. Come on, Canada, you're supposed to be on top of these things. Forget this place. I want my money back. I invested 900 boyfriends. I now have uh, a little over a thousand boyfriends, so I'm gonna cash that in. This is not enough to immigrate, I'm pretty sure. When was this made? 2007. Uh... I guess the Netherlands it is. Unless Jamaica, in which case they don't care. Uh, Latvia, Macedonia, Mozambique, New Zealand, Nicaragua, North Korea. Netherlands, that's the stuff. I need 38,000 Canada dollars. How much do I have? Not that much. I don't have enough. Alright, we gotta wait until next month. Or year. Your brother Kadao's wife, Luan, has given birth to a new baby boy named Anthony. That's not a Vietnamese name, I'm pretty sure. Maybe she moved to Canada, too. I haven't been paying attention. Hmm. Well, let's smuggle ourselves to the Netherlands. And the great Netherlands, illegally, I have been deported. Although, thankfully... Attempting to illegally leave and enter another country does not impact my uh, standing as a police inspector, and thank God for that. Nobody seems to mind. A major fire has hit Canada. 17 people have died and 16,000 others have been affected. You are not directly affected, of course. Can I cross the border again, please? And a great Netherlands. Oh, cool, I got in. So I can move to apostrophe s Hertogen Bosch in Nord Brabant Leistad Flevoland. That's a great name, Flevoland. Ultrecht, Ult Amsterdam. I know that one. Maastricht, uh, Edenhoven, Harlem. Cool. Just like New York. Lil Warden in Friesland. Oh man, Friesland sounds great. Go to Groningen and Groningen or Rotterdam. I've heard of that one too. All right, fine. Guess I'm not going to Friesland. I will go to Amsterdam. I moved to Amsterdam. Time to get married. 
Post marriage. She except wait, but no, it was a guy. Nathan Harvey's a woman. Wait, I the Oh god, I'm so confused now. What is anything? Uh well, I'm glad to see this game takes a very progressive stance on sexuality. Um, my boyfriend is now a girlfriend. Okay, I'm engaged to a woman by the name of Nathan Harvey. Sure, I'll take it. Age a year, please. I'm now 33. Oh, I don't have a job. That's a problem. Uh, do 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 Career. Get a job. I can be... Uh, electronic equipment operator. Police captain? How do I qualify for captain? Wait, what? No. How am I a captain? I just illegally immigrated to this country. I don't speak a word of the language. No, I'm gonna keep saying... I'm gonna keep asking until I get this. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. 4,100 euros a month. Who says crime doesn't pay? Okay. Leisure time, I would like to do some fashion, socializing, reading, studying, and arts. Do some art. Wait, did I marry my person yet? Or do I have to wait a year for that? I guess we just got engaged and not married. Why are we not married? Where is she? Age a year, please. Yeah, you and Nathan Harvey have married. Okay. Oh, college. You are spending very little compared to others of similar means. Would you like to reconsider? Sure. I'm going to give it all to charity. As you guys should. Wait, it's a... She's a policeman. He's a policeman. Nathan is a policeman. Adequate. No, ample. Just screw it. Just spend all of it. I don't... Can I afford that? No, I can't. Modest living, I guess. Alright, fine. Uh, saintly and careful shopper, please. Thank you. Age a year. Your sister Tron has given birth to Maria. Your spending is creeping up. Somehow. I am now here to... Tramp it back down. Uh, or tamp it back down, I'm sorry. Not tramp it back down. I'm not going to hobo it back. Uh, careful shopper. There we go. Partner. Cool. Your brother Kadao's wife Luan has been involved in a road traffic accident, but fortunately suffered no permanent injuries. Okay. That's my response. She just calls me up. Hey, my husband's been hit by a car. Okay. Hang up. I'm done. Your sister Tron has given birth to Clara. Clara? Tron Jr. Yes. Your spending's creeping up. Again. Hey, did you know most city dwellers in the Netherlands live in apartments? That's great. I feel like I'm there. Uh, monthly expenses. Cut this back down to careful. Again. Your spending's creeping up. Cut this back down to careful. Again. I'm now 39. Now I'm now 40. I'm now 41. I'm going to ask for a raise. I don't think I deserve it, but... Career. Ask for a raise. I got 2%. Okay. Your sister Tron's husband, Kadao, has given up drinking. I can't keep these people straight. Have a child, sure. I mean, it said Nathan was a woman, so I'm gonna have to... I guess I could try to have a kid, I don't know. I mean, I'm 42, I better have one fast. Uh, what do I need to do? Oh, cut down spending again. Uh, have a kid? You did not get... I didn't get pregnant. Well, I'd, I'd hope not. I don't think I'm able to. I guess you could try again. I, I didn't get pregnant. All right. Well, keep trying. I'm not that barren, am I? Oh. 
Why can't I have babies? Oh, this is a terrible game. Uh, one day science will catch up. But until then, I guess... I guess I cannot personally have babies. Oh, well. Ah, uh, darn. Your sister Tron has been involved in a road traffic accident, but fortunately suffered no permanent injuries. Unlike me, where I can't have babies. Permanently. Your sister Tron's given birth to a new baby boy named Philip. Oh, thanks, Tron. Just rub it in, why don't you? Uh, how much money do I have? I have 600,000 euros, so I'm going to do the smart thing with all this money and invest it in high-risk stock. Perfect. I don't want to adopt. If I can't get pregnant, I don't want it. It's the only way I want kids. They come from me. Your father has developed prostate cancer. How old is my father? My spending is creeping up. Ah. I am bitter. Can't get pregnant. I'll show you. One day it'll happen. One day I'll get pregnant. I'll show you all. Your brother Kadao's wife, Luan, has become diabetic. Something, something, Paula Dean. Your home has been broken into and burglarized. They stole 229 euros from me. You know, that's really not a big deal. Great, you stole... What? My PlayStation. My television. Let's see, I invested 600,000 euros, which is now worth... 745,000 euros. That's pretty good. A smart man would take the money back out of the account, but I'm far from smart, so I'm going to invest another 60,000 euros into high... Oh, that's 600. Uh, 60,000 into high-risk stock. Sure, just don't consolidate them. That's fine. Uh, age a year, please. Your sister Tron's given up drinking. My spending is creeping up. My spending is creeping up because I have taken up drinking because I can't have kids. That's what's happening here. Finances, please. I would like to change my expenses to less than insane... Can I have a kid? Ugh, I didn't get pregnant. I'm 48. Why? Ugh. 49? Why can't I get pregnant? This is driving me nuts. My father died at age 80 from prostate cancer. Great. Dad's out of the picture. Can I get pregnant now? Ugh. You know what? Fine. I'm too old and also a man. I don't see why either of those things have to be a factor. Come on, Nathan. You're bringing me down. I'm a police captain. You're a policeman. I love how a couple of legal immigrants of uh, ambiguous gender at this point are making almost are making way over a hundred thousand euros a year. That's nuts. I mean, money can't buy fertility, I guess. But still, that's pretty insane. Age a year, please. I am a really sexy middle-aged man. 97 appearance, still. Get a raise, fine. I will. I'm gonna ask for a raise. Oh, it's been refused. You know what? I'm gonna ask again. I'm going to keep asking until I get it. Uh, no. I'm going to get this raise. Denied a raise. Denied a raise. Denied a raise. Yeah, 3%. Can I ask again? I'm just going to wait for them to fire me. No. Oh, you've already received a raise this year. Well, fine. And then my mother died. But I got that raise. I've inherited 48,720 euros from my parents. And my spending is creeping up. Again. Don't know why that keeps happening. Thank you, Mom. Now going to invest all of your money into a dumb, dumb thing. Oh, God, that's... Okay, this... This is originally 60,000. It's now 28,000. 
I'm taking this back. This was originally 600,000, it's now 900,000, that's nuts. I now have 976,000 euros just in my pocket, not even in the bank or anything. Uh, eh, screw it, whatever. High risk stock, just all of it. 976,000 euros. Okay, I'll take it. I am a wealthy, wealthy fugitive. My sister Tron's husband, Kadao, has developed arthritis of the hip. You have found a wallet with a hundred euros. You can pocket the money or try to find the owner. Well, that's really not a lot of money, so sure, I'll give it back. The owner of the wallet has given you ten euros in gratitude. Pfft, ten euros. I've got... No, oh, that's not what I want. Nope. Oh god, all my money. <laughs> I just lost 200,000 euros. Ah, give it back. I'll just put it in a... Land? I wonder if land is stable. 2007. I guess the housing bubble's coming up, so maybe not. Just put it in the bank. Fine. I'll play it safe. I'm too old for this crap. 735,000 euros in the bank. You see, what actually happened was the guy that I gave the wallet to, he robbed me and then gave me 10 euros, so I wouldn't suspect it was him. Your brother Kadao's wife, Luan, has died at age 61 from chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Okay. Fine by me. I'm 55, and still really, really attractive. And really, really smart. Not very happy. Oh well, can't have it all. I'm 56, and no less sexy. My spending is creeping up. Jeez, at this rate, I can just run for president or something. I'll just have a hostile takeover. I'm a police captain, I mean, I can just use my forces for evil. Also, stop spending so much money. Can I get a better job, I wonder? Career. I'm gonna ask for a rise. Rise. Raise. 2%. Okay. What other jobs are there? Change jobs. Uh, none of them as good as this one. Oh, I could be a beggar! Wow, that's such an improvement. Oh god. A locomotive engineer. I don't think so. Haven't had very good luck with that. Oh, I cannot be a senior government official. That's a shame. Also, cannot be a mathematician. A general manager? I'd assume they mean an army general? A general manager of what? Oh, well, whatever. I wonder if basketball manager falls under the heading of general manager. You have been robbed! They stole 3.5 thousand euros from me. Oh. How much money do I have in the bank? Not really bringing up that much. Eh. Cash in. Let's put it in a mutual fund. Or a bond. How about that? 850,000 euros into a bond. That should be relatively safe. Age a year, please. I'm now 60. And still, no less sexy. 60-year-old, sexy police captain. Uh, why is my money... Why are my expenses so high? Oh, because I have more food. Giving a saintly amount to charity, which is the lion's share of my expenses right there. 61. Spending's creeping up. Again. Try to have a child at 60. Oh, still not getting pregnant. What a world we live in. I can't get pregnant at 60. And male. They call this realistic. I'm now 62. 63! My strength and endurance is going down, but I'm still one sexy beast. One sexy senior. One hot grandpa. This is getting really weird, I'm sorry. Uh, five years passed without incident. Alright. 
Uh, what am I trying to do? Eh, try to have a kid again. I'm 64. Darn. Your sister Tron has given up drinking. Okay. Your sister Tron's husband, Kadaubs, died from an opportunistic infection due to his weakened condition. Sure. Good job. Age a year, please. Your spending's creeping up. Don't care. You are too old to work as a police captain. Oh, Does this mean I'm fertile? They fired me because I was fertile, maybe? What else can I work as? I can be... I can be... I can be... None of these... Oh, wait, I can be, actually... An electronic equipment operator? Or a sales... Oh, man, I'm gonna be a salesperson. I'm gonna use my sex appeal to sell so many steak knives. Uh, fashion, please, and social... Eh. No, no socializing. Studying. And... Music, I guess. Oh, wait, I can pick more. And art. Okay. My monthly income is now poop. I gotta cut back on my spending. Oh, that's still not enough, is it? Eh, who cares? I got enough money for this. It's all in the bank. In some bonds. Yep, that's enough money to live on forever. No actions taken on investments or loans. Okay. 67. 68. Why did I hit 66 and have to retire as a police captain, but my partner is 68, and he, or she, I don't even know, is a policeman? How do you have a 68-year-old policeman? What kind of crime do you fight that way? Uh, 69? Okay, well, if there's any age where I'm going to have a kid, it's going to be this one. And it didn't work, so I guess I'm doomed. Your sister Tron has developed rheumatoid arthritis. Okay. Your brother Kadao has died at age 77 from kidney disease. Alrighty. Your sister Tron has died at age 66 from rheumatoid arthritis. Okay. What well, action will I do? Oh, I need to cash in my bonds, which are now worth over a million euros. Yeah, cash in all of it. My partner is now a 72-year-old policeman. How? How does... Uh, why are you not fired yet? Oh, wait. I should retire because I'm kind of dying. All right, hang on. Uh, where's my job? Quit job! Arr, six leisure time activities. Art, music, study, fashion, uh, political activism, I guess? And... Outdoor activities. Low exertion. My kind of stuff. Alright. Monthly income, zero. Oh, my health is still going down. I'm still sexy. I'm sick and sexy. Oh no, my partner. Come on, Nathan. You're 74. Give up the badge. It's killing you. Stop. Okay, no, it's going back up. Never mind. I have maxed out my conscious, or my conscience, and my appearance is not any worse than it was before. Get pregnant, I'm 77. Oh no, it's not gonna let me. Oh, they broke into my house. You stole, <laughs> you stole 610,000 euros from me. I'm 78 years old and damn sexy. I don't deserve this. However, it made my conscience now 100. I'm broke. But at least I feel good about it. Age a year, please. 80. Your partner Nathan has died from an opportunistic infection due to his weakened condition. Nathan! I'm gonna keep you in my house anyway. I'll never forget you. Let me just find some new romance. I met a new man named Joachim Heifman. Would I like to get involved? His appearance is 93. He's a sexy 73-year-old. Wow, I'm a cradle robber. I'm 81. Uh, yeah, I'm all for that. He feels the same way. Well, that's great. 
I am fine with that. That's a catch. Oh, no, not sports. Outdoor activities, please. Can we get married? Let's get married. Propose marriage! Oh, it's too early. Oh, no, he broke up! Yeah, well, I was sexier anyway, so fine. Ugh. Why do I still have Nathan in my house? He's dead. He's not doing anything. You've met a new man named Andre von Nostrand, whom you are very taken with. Would I like to get involved romantically? Yes, I would. Let's get married. Seems like a great time to propose marriage. She accepts. Boy, you man, you... Uh, why do I have this effect on people? Everyone I know is becoming female. My, now he's my boyfriend. Oh. So wait, I met a new man. Then I was engaged to her. Now she's my boyfriend again. And she died. Okay. That works. I'll take it. Um, My health is five, but that won't stop me from finding some loving. You've met a new man named Hans von Gelder, whom you are very taken with. Would you like to get involved romantically? Sure. He's a student? At 82? He's that guy in college who sits in front of the lecture hall and always asks the professor questions when he's trying to explain things. And he's also very sexy. 92 appearance. I'll take it. He feels the same way. Let's get married. She accepts. Great. I... Great. Okay, fine. You have died. Oh. But I died sexy. And that's all that matters. I died smart, sexy, and wise. I'm a really sexy corpse, and... Actually, no, I don't want to go down that route, so... Forget I said that. You have died. Okay. Oh. Now my happiness is zero. Oh, I'm not sexy anymore. I'm just zero. I'm just dirt. 